In this section of the video series, we're going to talk about time tracking here in FreshBooks. So if you run a business where you are billing your clients based on hourly rates instead of just a set fee for a particular project, and especially if you have staff members and contractors that are working on projects for your clients, using the FreshBooks time tracking feature is a great way to record how much time is spent on each project, what the cost of that time spent is based on the hourly rates of the staff member or contractor who's working on the project, and it's also a great way for your clients to get a good overview on what's going on with their project and the time that's being put into it. So from the FreshBooks home screen, I'm just going to go ahead and click on the time tracking section. And you'll notice when I do that, this calendar pops up. And this is where if I had already entered timesheets and projects, I could click on a specific day. And down here at the bottom, it's going to show me how many hours were logged on that day and for which particular project. So you can see there's quite a few aspects that go into the time tracking feature here in FreshBooks. We've got the final result, which is where we're at right now, which is the timesheet. But in order to do that, we've got to add a project, which I'm going to show you how to do in the next video in this series. We can add tasks for those projects, and those tasks can be reoccurring. Just like items on an invoice, these tasks can also go on an invoice, and you can charge a set hourly rate for multiple clients, even though it's the same task. You can group your team's timesheets together so that if you have multiple staff members working on the same project, you don't just have to look at the time each one of those staff members has spent on the project, but you can look at how much time the team as a whole has spent on one particular project. And then right from this time tracking section here in FreshBooks, we can go ahead and we can generate invoices based on the time spent on a particular project. So stay tuned for the next video where we go ahead and we create our first project to enable time tracking.